Morning, Road Ragers. I've been asked many times, if you're lucky enough to become governor, what do you intend to do? Well, uh, if the mass mandates are still in effect, if I'm lucky enough to become governor, they will be repealed. No state worker is going to be required to take a test once a week and re be required to wear masks at work. What's the point in getting vaccinated? The idea is that you're protected from those who might not be vaccinated and those who are not vaccinated. Why are you wearing a mask to protect yourself from spreading or contracting the coronavirus from other people who are not vaccinated, both of whom have made the decision to take the risk? I have been vaccinated. I'm an old man. I have comorbidities. But a lot of people have made a very different decision. In California, anybody who wants to be vaccinated very likely has been. And if you're poor, there are programs so you can get vaccinated for free. Whatever happened to choice? Thomas Jefferson warned against trading freedom for public safety. Also, if I'm lucky enough to become governor, I'm going to consult with my legal counsel and find out whether or not I could issue an executive order on housing to unleash the private sector so low-cost housing can be built. I'm going to have a declaration of state of emergency for homelessness. I'm going to have a declaration of state of emergency if I'm able to do that for crime. And I'm going to have a declaration for state of emergency for the absolute ridiculous other mandates that this man has imposed that make it difficult for people to make a living and for owners of businesses to make a profit. And you know what? Then I'm going to break for lunch. In a few minutes, I'm going to be on the Maria Bartiromo show on Fox Business. I think it's around 635 Pacific time. And please throw something in the tip jar. Electelder.com, electelder.com, because we have a state to save. Out!